Welcome, beautiful souls of this world. It's a girl, Kulu Baby, and you don't know the thing already. What's going on? So happy to see y'all. You know what I mean. I mean, you know what I mean. Um, today, y'all, today, of course, y'all gonna be seeing this video way later than what today actually is. But today is October 1st, and it is the night or the day of the full harvest moon right for those of you that don't know that's it's real important okay so today i feel and believe that affirming something is just gonna be beautiful um manifestation is really going to happen and i'm just excited to see the card that we do pick today so anyways guys welcome to episode six i said it episode six wow we made it to six episodes and i just want to say again thank you so much for y'all that have been supporting me and sticking true with me and all of these things thank y'all so um before we get started as you can see i have a really beautiful um custom made organic african ghana piece on my head y'all this is so beautiful okay and of course as you know it is part of my distribution all the way from ghana from beautiful ghana my girl mabna hey mabna we love you <laughs> it is so beautiful so listen y'all it's a lot of a lot of a lot of things and merchandise that you know is in store y'all just gotta let me know what you want you see me but anyways so let's oh. dive right in as i said before tonight is a full moon right and guess what there will be some music going on tonight okay it will be a new track starting and manifesting and being composed okay because listen I take advantage of these times and I feel like everybody needs to take advantage of these times because this is where you manifest life that you want this is where you become who you are supposed to be you know this is where divine time really kick in right for your life and your journey wherever you are so you know I just hope that y'all are taking advantage of this moon as well so we're gonna dive right in to the request of topics that we got let's see okay guys so one of the requests that i do have is from george nichols from ohio woo, woo. you know i've never been to ohio it's a lot of places never touched yet but guess what it's gonna happen because i'm a wanderer For real. <laughs> so george nichols what's good george well, go on. george I says hey queen cooley um, with everything in the world going on right now, I just wanted to know your perspective on everything as far as COVID, as far as elections, as far as everything going on in the world right now. As a whole, what do you think and how are you going about everything? Well, hmm. one thing about me, I don't really tap into the politics world because, you know, I feel like a lot of people use politics to not use politics but i feel like a lot of people allow that's the word allow politics to control their minds control their life control their every move every decision every you know so i really don't like to tap into that because no matter what they doing or whatever god got me you understand what i'm saying yes president you know you, god is my president my creator my creator is my president and that's how i see it and a lot of people won't agree with me a lot of people will probably bash me or whatever the case that's not my concern either you know what i'm saying so as far as my perspective my life my journey politics i don't really dip and dab in there because as i said god is my governor god is my president 
God is my, and that's whoever God is to you. That could be the universe. That could be whoever God is to you, you know, but so as far as politics, George, I'm in early business. However, now with COVID, so the way I think I spoke about it in my, um, I spoke about it in my last, uh, I think it was episode two or something like that. Um, so I also don't really, I also don't really like to get into those conversations too, because again, everybody sees it differently and everybody believes what they believe. Now, what I will say is whether it's called COVID or (laughs) Corona or whatever the case is, I, what I do know is something is happening, right? Because people are dying. Now, how it's coming about or who is controlling it or that's a whole nother conversation. (laughs) We don't know, but what I do know is it's happening and a lot of people are dying a lot of people are being affected and it's affecting families it's affecting relationships it's affecting jobs it's affecting it's affecting the world as a whole right so what i would say is this george everything every single thing that is happening right now i am a firm believer of divine time i am a firm believer of everything happening for a specific reason now we may not be able to decipher what that reason is. we may not understand what's going on we may not know for a fact exactly what's going on but i feel like everything happens for a reason and everything happens in divine timing so with all these things going on right now in the world and uh, you know a lot of people and everything is being affected and i know that my creator is at work i know for a fact that my creator is trying to get our creator let me say that it's trying to get our attention that i do know and whoever won disagree that's cool too like i told y'all disagreeers and this platform is for us to agree to disagree this platform is for us to open our our minds open our eyes broader than what than where we already are with ourselves You know, this platform is to, you know, tap into someone else's perspective and, you know, try to see where they're coming from. So with that being said, I just feel like our creator is really trying to get our attention. And um, I feel like as a whole, this world as a collective, no matter if you're white, brown, black, purple, whatever the case is, now is the time for us to come as a collective and rise. That's what I'm getting from this. That's how I feel. That's how I see it. Remind you, this is a fallen world that we're living in right now. It's fallen. So honestly, everything around you, everything you see around you, it's an illusion. These things, material things, all these things, it's an illusion. It's not real. But what is real is spirits. What is real is our souls. What is real is the spiritual world that we do not see. Right now, it's the spiritual warfare going on. A lot of us are lost. A lot of us are lost. And a lot of us, if we don't wake up now and start doing the things that we are told to do and start doing the things that that we are destined to do, we're going to be in trouble. You know, so this is the next reason why this platform is here is so we can start preying ourselves, our higher selves and working towards our better selves, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? So, George, I thank you so much for asking that question, because I feel like a lot of people need to really tap into themselves and tap in real deep further real deep deeper than what we see around us deeper than what we do every on a daily basis okay you got a routine right you wake up you go to work come home cook dinner whatever you sleep and you wake up the next day and you do it all over again right but are you doing it with purpose are you doing it with a positive 
purpose behind it like you know what i'm saying like are we just living to work then die or are we living to work help intervene with ourselves grow elevate and fulfill your purpose all right now y'all it's time to do some interventions it's time to do some self evaluations it's time to do some self interventions if you even have someone that you love shoot do an intervention with them you know have you guys whether it's a group of y'all or just two of y'all whatever you know sit around together if you need to like some sage set the positive atmosphere and have an intervention a positive intervention not an intervention that's going to let someone else feel like oh you're downing me or you're you're judging me or you're coming at me as you're better than me or something no what we're doing is we are acknowledging everything we need to acknowledge within ourselves and seeing how we can be better be a better us for the world cuz as we always said we not in this world for ourselves we're in this world for each other so help me help me to help you that makes sense help me to help me help you help me help you but help me to help me help you that's a deep one that's a deeper one so george i just want to say thank you so much y'all again i'm gonna keep saying this till y'all get it okay when y'all send in requests please send in your information send in your social media send in a picture because guess what i would love to promote you as well this platform is for us also to network with each other get to know each other get to love on each other that's what this is for so y'all when y'all send requests as i said i will always keep saying this until y'all get it until y'all do it <laughs> when you're sending in your request send your social media accounts and send a picture so we can start talking to each other okay so thank you again George I really appreciate your support and watching my episodes and deciding to ask your know. question and the topic thank you so much for tuning in also and y'all I need some guests who's going to be a guest I need some guests now and yes CB17s we travel Coolie baby expresses and positive affirmations we travel so let me know if you want me to come to you because I will and we will get the manifestation on we will get the affirming on and we're going to do the we're going to do the test you know it's a full moon y'all of harvest do y'all know what harvest is let's talk about it okay so according to google right the definition the of harvest is the process or period of gathering in crops now i'm gonna just leave that right there it's crazy because what did george ask me and what did i say togetherness coming together we need to come together as a whole collective come together what is this moon the harvest moon the process or period of gathering in crops y'all we are and we are being gathered the awakened ones are being gathered right and that's why I do what I do because not everyone is awakened that's okay everybody deserves to be where they are in their journey cuz guess what at one point in time I wasn't as awake as I am now you know what I'm saying so it's okay we all are at a specific space and place in our journey and that's divine that's where we're supposed to be at that time right so but listen this moon this moon this moon and y'all see my makeup so as you know I'm also a makeup artist and coolie baby beatings that's what it's called and um you know I did like a a sunset moon kind of look you know if you can really see you can't see if you go to my Instagram page you will definitely see the look and the video actually i'm going to post the video on youtube as well so you should catch the the video on youtube as well but yes so harvest coming together crops gathering coming together y'all what y'all trying to do are y'all trying to harvest are y'all trying to harvest for the rest of this year and next year? This we prepping. We prepping. What's going on? Y'all talk to me.
because me and Harvest, you know, I'm going to be harvesting. It's harvest time. It's harvest oh. time. So we're gonna get right into this affirmation. I'm so excited and anxious and anticipating the one that we pick because y'all already know every time we pick one, I always go back to what we talked about. So let's see. Ooh, this one looking, oh wow. This one looking real harvesty. Real harvesty. <laughs> this is what I meant by real harvesty. <laughs> okay. So this one says, I see the light and choose to reside in its loving presence. I see the light and choose to reside in its loving presence. Y'all, are we not about to see this beautiful harvest light tonight? Are we not about to be, ah, I got chill bumps, I got chill bumps. Are we not about to be under this beautiful harvest moon this beautiful harvest light yo we reside in it well i know i'm definitely residing in this beautiful beautiful harvest light that's about to touch down tonight but listen y'all take this and use it to your advantage manifest positive affirm Get, get your life where it divinely needs to be. You understand? So, y'all already know the drill. We're going to say this three times, and we're going to say it like we mean it. Y'all, I am so excited. <laughs> All right, so let's say it like we mean it. Okay, okay guys, so we're going to go ahead and say three times and affirm like we know who we are and like we know what we're manifesting, right? So on the count of three, one, two, three. I see the light and choose to reside in its loving presence. I see the light and I choose to reside in its loving presence. I see the light and I choose to reside in its loving presence present yes guys i am so excited and listen i'm gonna have my own little thing going on at 10 when the moon actually is so present and you know what i think i'm gonna go outside and just indulge in it that's what i think i'm gonna do hopefully it don't rain because you know so i'm in florida and it's hurricane season and i can't wait but y'all i love y'all so much thank y'all so much for tuning in Bless up yourself. I'm sending you love, peace, joy, happiness, light, and blessings. Listen, no matter what's going on around you, remember, it's your soul that counts. It's your soul that matters. It's what you do that counts. It's what you think that counts. You know what I'm saying? So no matter what anything is going on around you, elevate. Be your higher self. Strive to be your higher self at all times and you will never go wrong. You will never go astray because guess what? Our creator would never, ever lead us astray. Never. So I love y'all so much. Thank you so much for tuning in. Big up on the set and let's harvest some things tonight, okay? Let's do that and let's manifest and let's affirm and let's get our life divinely in order. <laughs> cool baby day I done know the thing up bless up on the self make sure y'all stream all the music is all out there just go coolie baby stream it all <laughs> and also make sure you get the merchandise look this is a beautiful piece y'all okay and it's more where this come from coolie baby waist beads coolie baby masks so many things is going on right now and I'm like ah and I got some clothes coming y'all just stay tuned okay but I love y'all so much. You done know the tinga. Big up on the self. And coolie B-A-B-I-I. -I. Coolie baby, act like you know it. If I act like you know it. It will be a new track. <clears throat> that day. Are you doing it with 
ask your question and let's talk about and it's it's not you know he's trying to get excuse me Ooh. remind you uh. go on your bed with with um or who oh okay savannah jo oh y'all mm, 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 mm. bro i think it's like at 10 5 p.m okay this is happening because it is or this is happening because you know because of this i'm gonna grow or or harvesting harvesting I know I did. Woo, woo, woo. Excuse me. We are being well. The oh, the the. You heard the definition of harvest is to. But anywho's, um, let it not rain, and I'm gonna be out there like. <laughs> really bo you just like you just messing up the video i know you see me doing the video bo that's what we doing we just gonna hop in the middle of the video hey see me doing this video you know what you see all your tongue you see it's all right time cool the baby day i'm walking away ever since the day when me walking on you me can't shake your presence me stalking on you from your mind and your heart till you soul your aura but you never see me that's weird you put me in a friend's one box you tell me so you're not dead no girl with locks all of my friend them say i'm crazy just for once in you for me the push the pull the talk i want it can't go no further the crying the train revealing my scars i can't say no longer the years when me try despite it me stay yeah i can't go no longer my life them like on me drip, drip yeah. yeah them said them like on me drip, drip, yeah. drip. me give thanks unto the most high cause the strip is the truth and the strip is legit why coming from where me i come from climbing up the ladder and the steps one by one nobody can say me run run cause anything me take responsibility when it's said i know me no in a day one no hype trip out the bank call it dynamite if step into me you better step right no light no light everybody wants a taste them one cut off a piece of the cake but then i know sir it's a irate i agree <laughs> alicia mm. me don't know what do the people yeah me don't know like them don't really know what really i go on over y'all see isn't me like i mean y'all need a tip <laughs> just pre the drip okay alicia hit my line up it put me on this remix all this drip up on this track on how your nigga seasick he been all up in